We are proud to introduce Atlas TI-9. Be a researcher, not a software specialist. Get things done with the most intuitive and easy to learn software for qualitative data analysis and mixed methods in science, market, and user experience research. Meet our family of software tools. With the new Atlas TI account, you will have access to all platforms, our Windows, Mac, Cloud, Android, and iPad versions. We now present you with the new version 9 features. When you open Atlas TI, you see the welcome screen. Here you can see a list of all of your projects. The welcome screen is also the place where you can create new projects or import existing ones. Click on your avatar to access your Atlas TI account and review your license information. You can also access the searchable online help and the selection of sample projects from the welcome screen. Stay up to date by reading the news, or take a look at our latest video tutorials. We have completely revamped the autocoding feature and implemented the newest artificial intelligence technologies. When defining a query for a text search, you can combine search expressions with Boolean operators, use synonyms, and inflected forms. Search results can be reviewed and coded one by one, or you can code them all at once. Atlas TI-9 also includes named entity recognition. You can think of named entity recognition as a special autocoding procedure, where you as the user do not enter a search term. Instead, Atlas TI goes through your data and finds entities for you. The results can be reviewed and coded as you read them, or you can automatically code all of the results. Another new feature is sentiment analysis. With sentiment analysis, Atlas TI finds sentiments in your data that reflect a positive, neutral, or negative sentiment. You can review the results and code the data as you read them, or you can let Atlas TI automatically code all the data by its sentiment. Next, we have reinvented the entire process of coding. You spend lots of time coding your data, so we wanted to make this as convenient as possible. When double-clicking on a quotation, the coding dialog opens. You can pick one of the existing codes and apply it, or enter a new one. You can also see all the codes that have already been applied. If you want to remove a code, simply click on the minus button. To retrieve coded data, the quotation reader will be your future best friend. You can see all the codes that have been applied on the right-hand side in the margin. If you have an idea or want to write down a detailed interpretation for a quotation, you can do this in the comment field below. You can remove codings, as well as apply new codes to a quotation. Text editing is back, as well as paragraph numbering and print with margin. The print with margin option allows you to print out a document as you see it on the screen with the codes appearing on the right hand side. It is also possible to save it as a PDF document. The reference provided for a quotation has also been improved, and this is visible in reports. This quotation is in paragraph 344 in document 2. The name of the document is M. Trevor. Furthermore, we are excited to present new ways of visualizing data in Atlas TI-9. Here you see the color map in the code document table. Another new way to visualize the data of the code document and the code co-occurrence table is in the form of a Sankey diagram. You can select various color options, including a dark background. You can rotate the diagram and also reposition the nodes. This allows you to explore and present the data in different ways, which can provide new and unique insights.
We've also added the following features to Atlas TI 9 Mac. Word clouds as an alternative way to present word lists. You can apply stop and go lists. Zoom to the most frequent words. Or show inflected forms only. This could be useful, for example, if you do not want to differentiate between play and playing, as shown here. Restricting queries to documents or document groups is now also possible in the Query tool. You can use Boolean operators to combine documents or document groups. This makes it very easy to compare and contrast data. Other new features include Partial bundles for easier project portability An audit trail for code merging Stop lists in over 30 languages An option to create a new relation while linking codes or quotations in networks Dark mode in the Mac version an optimized user interface with many new usability features, like empty states and redesigned tools. Atlas TI 9 Windows is now a 64-bit application for extra power and speed. This was Atlas TI 9 in a nutshell. As always, we wish you happy coding! If you are watching this video on YouTube, you can find a link to our shop in the description below. On our website, click on Order Now to buy your upgrade or your first Atlas TI license today.